This story begins in the gritty streets of New York City, where Sylvia and her friend Raven navigate their lives as street escorts. They can't help but gaze longingly at the penthouse that belongs to Ronnie Price, a dashing millionaire who have them both swooning. Sylvia, driven by her vanity, believes her looks are her ticket to a better life, one that would lift her from the squalor of the streets. Raven, however, reminds her that even beauty can't change their status in the lower echelons of society. The conversation takes a dark turn when Raven's pimp attempts to recruit Sylvia, leading her into a dimly lit alley. With calculated finesse, Sylvia plays along with the pimp, who believes he is about to exploit her. But when his guard is down, she swiftly reveals her concealed weapon, forcing him to surrender all his valuables. The pimp, desperate, attempts to fight back, leading to Sylvia's deadly retaliation. Leaving him for dead, she dashes past Raven, announcing her newfound freedom. Sylvia's next stop is a pawn shop, where she attempts to trade the stolen jewelry with the shop owner, Joe. While inspecting the jewels, a distraught elderly lady with a veil enters the shop and begins to attack the shopkeeper, yelling and screaming at him before succumbing to her elderly age and leaves. The shop owner quickly recognizes that the goods are stolen and refuses to trade with Sylvia. Repulsed, Sylvia turns to leave but is halted by Joe, who sees potential in her. Despite her misconceptions, Joe clarifies that he is not interested in a sexual exchange but rather her beauty. This ambiguous offer is backed by the offer of $10,000 in cold, hard cash. The eerie deal includes a plaster cast of her head for money, an offer too good to refuse. The transaction is in line with the store's policy of a four-month payback for any exchange. Joe begins the plaster process but seems to be casting a spell over the ingredients as he starts the procedure. As the camera pans away, we see that this is not Joe's first time making this arrangement. As Sylvia leaves the store, we see that Joe's strange procedure has something to do with the resurrection of his deceased wife, whom he has stored in the back of his pawn shop. With her newfound wealth, Sylvia indulges in a lavish transformation, adorning herself in high-end fashion and elegant makeovers. She crashes one of Ronnie's extravagant parties, and through charm and flirtation, attracts an enthralling romance with the millionaire. Fast forward four months later, Sylvia is living the grand life she once longed for with Ronnie. However, things start taking a harrowing turn. Sylvia starts displaying signs of rapid aging. As her beauty wanes, Ronnie suggests she visit a dermatologist. Despite being given a clean bill of health, the doctor inquires if Sylvia has had any interactions recently that could have contributed to her fleeting age. Sylvia suddenly recalls her ominous agreement with Joe and rushes to the pawn shop. She discovers her ticket has expired the day before in regards to the store's four-month exchange policy. Sylvia pulls a gun on Joe and demands he name his price to reverse the curse. Joe demands $100,000 as his price. In a desperate bid to repay Joe, Sylvia resorts to theft, stealing all the valuables in Ronnie's opulent residence while he is away on business. Her sinister plan is interrupted when Ronnie unexpectedly returns home, catching her in the act. To her dismay, he doesn't recognize her, mistaking her for a destitute old woman seeking refuge. Fueled by anger at his failure to recognize her, Sylvia reveals her identity and shoots him dead. Panicking, Sylvia drops her weapon and flees to Joe's pawn shop. She empties her loot, which value far exceeds Joe's asking price. Joe then reveals why he needs Lady's beauty in exchange for revitalizing and reanimating his wife. Joe inquires if she wants her true identity back, reminding her of her fugitive status for the murder of Ronnie. Suddenly, a police officer enters the shop, discussing Ronnie's murder. He derides the killer for her careless actions, leaving behind a murder weapon and fingerprints. The officer relays that this woman will be caught and sentenced to death. Terrified of her impending fate and accepting that she must remain with this new identity to evade the law, Sylvia grabs her molded model and makes a swift escape, only to collide with her former colleague Raven, who does not recognize Sylvia and abuses her. In the midst of the chaos, her sculpture, the embodiment of her beauty, shatters on the New York pavement. Sylvia finds herself consumed by despair, resigned to her seemingly inevitable demise. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notifications, and leave a like to help the channel out. Thanks for watching.